Oh my gosh. I'm already so excited. It already looks cool. Hi, Barbie dolls. I'm just a Barbie. Barbie lover in West Hollywood. Thanks for watching my video. Today, I'm customizing Barbie necklace. Yay! Here's Barbie 90s logo necklace, which I bought from Barbie truck. So now I have one, two, three of them. One I'm gonna use as a necklace, and two others I wanna make it into earrings. You know what? Even for necklace, I don't wanna wear this as it is right now. The Barbie plate part looks really pretty, but I'm not a huge fan of this gold chain look, like a regular gold chain. I don't think this chain is really matching to this plate, you know? In a camera, it's so hard to show you, but in a person, it's a really, really pretty color. So I went to Joanne earlier today, and I got some little parts, beads. I want to customize this necklace into Azusa Barbie style, and also making these into earrings. Please enjoy watching this DIY video today. <laughs> okay, let's start. So let's start from necklace. Isn't it pretty? One necklace was $16. Yellow gold doesn't look good on my skin. And then today I found these charms, some stars or more bees. Yeah, so I'm not 100% sure about the design yet, but I just got a bunch of stuff. Yeah, so I will try to see which one looks the best with this. And yeah, I'm gonna just put them all together. Since this logo is 90s logo, so that's why I didn't think this thin, delicate chain was the one for this logo. I more thought this thick, thick one would look perfect with this. Kind of reminds me like 90s, like a hip hop, hip hop fashion, you know? I wanna try with this. Oh my gosh, I'm already so excited. It already looks cool. Too much, maybe too much, huh? You know what? I was totally gonna put these cute charms, but let me show you. Doesn't it just look perfect without charms? I really like how it looks simple. I would definitely keep it more simple. Uh, but I kind of want to put maybe just a little, maybe. Yeah, but not the huge one. Yeah, I changed my mind. I will make it more simple. It's gonna be so awesome. I think it looks super cute. So I've been trying to figure out the best design. <laughs> yeah, I have like tried more than several different ways and <laughs> I know it looks so messy. And then now I think I figured out like I'm using this little pink star. Yeah, I think it's gonna be super cute. Just with these clear beads, they look too subtle, but I want to make it more pop and street style. Yeah, actually this pink star is from kit section but I can totally use this for my jelly. Super cute. It's gonna be perfect. 
Now I'm finally happy with how I put these beads. I'm gonna change these because I like this side better. Yay! I love it! <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute! I love it! Now I'm gonna work on my earrings. Let's decide the best design. Yay! Super cute! Oh my god! I made these upside down each other on purpose. Oh my god, so cute! Look, 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 look. Yay! Ta da! Oh my gosh! I love this so much. So, first of all, I did necklace. I changed the chain to a thicker one, and also I put several beads on. Yeah, earrings. So I did upside down for each other, you know, to make balance well. And I put the matching beads. First I was thinking to put the huge charms, but um, it was too heavy and also it looked too gorgeous, like a too luxury look. But since it's the 90s logo, so I wanted to make it more street style. These turned out really good. Like a really good. And you know what? In the camera, I noticed it doesn't look that iridescent. It looks more gold-ish, but it's just because of lighting. So under natural light, they will look crazy rainbow-ish iridescent. Oh my gosh. I'm glad that I ended up with not having the huge charm because they're not heavy at all. Yeah, I totally feel comfortable. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you like my video, subscribe my channel, and follow me on Instagram. Hope you have a fantastic Barbie day. Bye.